Hey guys, Chris Reuter from Telius here. Another week, another week of being cooped up, so we may as well make the most out of it and go somewhere virtually. This week, we're going to be going to Brazil. Welcome to Rio, or a couple hundred miles north of Rio. That's the source of our data set that we're going to be talking about today. We're going to be analyzing medical no-show appointments. So if someone showed up for an appointment or not. And can we predict that based upon demographics, maybe pre-existing conditions, or even external factors? So let's get started. First, we're going to look very quickly at our data. Again, a pretty clean data set. I'll post a link below. Um, but we've got pre-existing conditions like hypertension and diabetes, demographic data, gender, age. We've also got some good external data that we got from the NOAA, which is actually a weather, from a weather station near the town that we're looking at. So we've got precipitation and average temperature. We'll connect those and we'll join them based upon day. And then we'll look at some visualizations. So we've already built these. We're looking at weather analysis. So average temperature, or was it warm or cool or really average? Rain, the amount of rain, pre-existing conditions and even age. But these are only one or two factors on individual charts. This is a classic dashboard. We want to understand the entire picture. So first, we're going to ask a question that we really care about. We're going to just type in, show me appointments uh, daily. So we're going to look at the overall number of appointments across our entire data set by day. Talius figures out what we want, and then it shows us. Now we can refine this just by continuing to type our question. So we're interacting with our data. We're going to say where no show is equal to yes. We're only interested in looking at the no shows. And we want to see that over time, just for May. So we'll type in for May 2016. After we do that, we can then remove any outliers. Just click and hit remove. Now we're seeing our trend over time. Maybe we can see with a, a big drop here on May 5th, what's driving no-shows to actually happen. So we click, okay, May 5th, check reasons. Telus is gonna show us this trend-based insight. So we do see a big drop, but we're only seeing a drop that is associated with neighborhoods. We're not seeing any patterns across pre-existing conditions or even the weather. So that makes sense across one day. Let's look at our entire data set. So we can here, see here when looking at our entire data set, the number one and two factors are, did they receive a reminder text message and their age? Now, we, reminder text message makes sense, so let's remove that. We'll take that out and we'll look just at age. So when looking just at age, we can see that uh, age is actually an 80% indicator of if someone is gonna show up for an appointment or not. So let's start making predictions based on this. So when you go, wanna start going making predictions, we just hit auto ML. We type in no-show. This is the variable that we want to predict. We're going to name our model and then actually hit predict. When we do hit predict, Telius actually kicks off machine learning processes in the background and then ranks them. So on our leaderboard here, you can see that our GBT classifier model is our number one machine learning model in terms of accuracy. It's got a 63% area under rock curve. That's pretty good. Now, that's the overall model. Let's understand for any one particular patient why they didn't show up. So we can hit explanation and we can, we can see, okay, for this particular patient, Telius is predicting, yes, they will no-show because of their neighborhood, they did receive a text message, and their age. We can see for the next person, for example, it's not really as much based on neighborhood. Instead, it's based upon age, did they receive a text message, and then actually average temperature and precipitation. So we learned a lot today. This is pretty interesting. We learned how to actually predict if someone is going to show up for a medical appointment or not. If you'd like to do this type of analysis yourself, I'll post a link to the data set as well as a link to Telius. You can try a free trial on your own, on your own, and you can try to do the same kind of things that I'm doing here. Thanks for watching and following along.